hello guys and welcome to the sixth video on how to make a custom room in the last video we have already uh, set up the kitchen folder also rooted the stock room and also installed the busy uh, busy box run parts also changed the name of the room to the nero road room so now what we have to do we have to edit the files inside the uh, stock room so that uh, we can ch change the look customize it add new themes etc inside the room so for that we are going to use apk tool to edit the apk file and dot jar file so now what we have to do we have to set up the apk tool folder for that we are going to get two files that is framework files from our stock room for that go to kaven home nero keychain and then to working folder and from now this working folder go to system framework and grab two files that is framework dash res dot apk and semac generic uxp res dot apk this might change uh, depending on the type of the device you are using or type of the room you are using so in my case these are the two files so just copy them and then copy it to the apk tool folder so now you have to open command prompt here just for that press shift from keyboard and then right click inside anywhere the folder and click open command window here so the command prompt is open inside the c apk tool folder now you have to press some command for uh, setting up the framework race and semac generic usp race table for using the apk tool here i have provided a readme inside this readme you have already provided all the command files that you are going to use you can just copy these uh, commands and paste it inside the command prompt else you can type it so i am going to tell you how to do that so on command prompt first of all type apk tool if framework dash res dot apk so this will install the if framework dash res file to your username slash apk tool folder so press enter so the framework is installed to user your username slash apk tool slash framework folder so similarly you are going to install semic generic UXP race so for that type apk tool space if type semic generic UXP race dot apk and that hit enter so the semic generic UXP race dot apk file is installed to the same framework directory inside apk tool of your username so here you have successfully installed these two files so now what we are going to do we are going to see how to edit the apk file unpack repack them for that i am going to use uh, a custom room from my uh, sorry custom file from my room and stock file from the system folder So from this apk tool folder you can delete these two files I am going to edit the default themes dot apk So I copy this modified default theme apk from which I am going to extract the images that I want Just uh, I rename it for simplicity as default theme older O for older there is no need to rename it but if you want you can re rename it as you want so dfo.apk is my reference default theme and from carving home nero keychain working folder system and this app folder we are, uh, i'm going to get the default stock themes 
so I just copy it to this apk tool and paste it I rename it as default theme new so now what I am going to do I am going to extract both of these files for that I am going to type apk tool space d space name of the file that we are going to decompile that is going to extract so dfo dot apk the whole command will be apk tool space d space dfo dot apk hit enter so backsmelling loading to resources table that is resources table is uh, loaded from the installed framework for uh, files that we have already done before in a few moments the whole uh, so procedure completes so here the dfo is extracted similarly extract the dfn file so for that we are going to type apk tool d dfn dot apk hit again enter and now the next file will be extracted so the extraction is about to complete extraction is done so now from the old file i have already edited the themes like this so these are new kinds of images and wallpapers that i have edited already so what i am going to show you just uh, we are going to edit the default themes as you can see the new file don't have such kinds of themes these are default themes so now i am going to change it so from this dfo we are going to copy these two files and paste it in dfn folder so the your dfn folder is now modified so dfn folder also consists of these new themes now go back to your uh, apk tool folder now type apk tool b for building and type the name of the folder that you want to build that is dfn so the whole command will be apk tool space b space dfn then hit enter so the whole building procedure is started now the apk tool will check for the changes that you have made and if there is any kind of error then it will report error else the apk is made so it takes a while during this whole procedure uh, you can do one thing now what we have to do now we are going to modify dfn so check this dfn apk file delete this apk extension and give it as dot zip so the dfn dot apk will become dfn dot zip open this zip file with winrar so you will get the meta nf and android manifest dot xml file so the building of apk file is done now go in dfn folder go in build folder go in apk folder and here you can see there is no meta nf folder so paste this meta nf and android manifest folder inside this file and just replace it so this is a step of signing our apk without any kind of error so just again type d apk tool b space d f n and hit enter the apk is now built so go back back and here inside this dfn folder you can see dist folder here your new apk file that is d f n dot apk is built just rename it to the default themes dot apk and now copy it after copying it go to your cabin home nero keychain and your working folder 
inside that working folder go to your system slash app and paste it so this is the new it is having larger size as we have ad added the hd themes and the hd files so just copy and replace it so here you go we have customized the default theme file and we have edited the apk file in next tutorial i will tell you how to edit the dot jar file this was for editing the dot apk file and also later on i will tell you how to edit xml file how to edit draw 9 file and how to compile without error using simple techniques on gimp thank you